It's the Mike Francesa podcast on the Bet Rivers Network. Bill, what is your reaction to WCBS 880 ending its all news format? All right, I'm sure there's, uh, I've had a couple of requests for uh, questions on this, and I have not answered any of them. Um, And I don't know if I'm going to answer this one the way you want, because first of all, was it surprising? The answer is yes. Does it sit well? It's not going to sit well with anybody who grew up like I grew up with, 88 being our sister station and being a legendary, iconic station as FAN grew to be. They were an iconic station before we were. They've been in business a very, very long time. They've done brilliant work there on the radio for many years. It is a format that was known far and wide. It was an incredibly successful format know many of those people there who are very good at what they do in all different jobs and so the relationship that I had as being a big part of WFAN which grew into an iconic station and had this sister station that we were very close to in working proximity and had a very close relationship with. So it's kind of like family for me. I have not talked to anybody on either side of the LMA. I have not talked to anybody from Odyssey. I have not talked to anybody from Good Karma. I have not talked to Craig Karmason. I have not talked to uh, anybody involved in the deal. So I'm not going to talk anything about the business end of this because I don't have all the facts, number one. Number two... Am I surprised that they would give ESPN and and LMA? Yes, of course I'm surprised. Anybody would be. Am I surprised that that, and saddened that that format's going away? Yes. And do I feel for the people who have worked there and done a great job there? Yeah, of course you do. You don't want to see anybody lose their job. So from that standpoint, it's tough to take, but... Again, I can't get into the business end of it because I haven't talked to anybody about it. Surprised, like everybody else, very surprised and very saddened because, like I said, we had a very close relationship with 88. They're our sister station. We shared a lot of radio history together. We have both filled up a lot of trophy cases with awards. We both have become iconic stations together. So it's like a family thing there. And I feel very much for the people there. I really do. And all I can say is that uh, CBS News Radio 88 will be missed. They were an iconic, legendary station for generations. And they will be sadly missed. 